Okay, so in this 4x4 bed I built here, we have, or we approximately had, 15 pepper plants. And they all, most of them got the curly leaf top virus from the leaf hopper. And you're supposed to, if you see the curly leaf top virus, you're supposed to destroy all your plants that have it so the leaf hopper will not spread the disease. But I decided to take a chance to see if any plants have resistance. And I've found approximately two that have great resistance. The others I just destroyed. Um, if you look at this one right here, very healthy. Maruga scorpion. This one right here, I think it was a Jay's Ghost Scorpion or Buchalokia. Um, this one has the disease. It's trying to fight it off. It looks like it's still producing. So it's showing some resistance. And this one right here, this is another one of the, my uh, Maruga Scorpions. Just showing great resistance. Just really, leaf hoppers just haven't done much to it. They've been biting it. I see the leaf hoppers on there, but the plant's resistant. It's showing great resistance. No leaf, uh, leaf top virus on this one. And uh, the rest of them, what, approximately, what, I got rid of, uh, what, 12 of them? I had to kill 12 of them. Because there was no new growth, had these small leaves, and just wasn't producing anything. So I said, about time I get rid of them, just cut them down. And um, this is where we are right now. So this is what I'm looking for. I'm going to save these seeds, hopefully maybe give them out, some free ones to my YouTubers, my friends on YouTube, or maybe some of my family that wants to grow some super hots. And uh, that's pretty much it. Showing resistance to the curly top virus, which is a great thing. Um, hopefully, it'll pass on that trait to the seeds. And also, a Tabasco I've read is uh, resistant to that disease as well from the leaf hopper. So, there we go. Thank you very much.